Hello, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to today's video. So I'm not really sure what this video is going to be, to be honest. Um, but I've had a parcel, a fairly big one, oh, there. Um, and I wanted to film unboxing it, so I don't know what this will go in with. But I need to open it because it's got some stuff in that I need to use. So yeah, um, I thought I'd film it and see where it ends up, to be honest. Um, so yes, yeah, big parcel. Can't really remember everything that I've got in here. Um, oh, exciting first thing. Something I have not bought in a very long time. Because if you saw my saddle pad collection, I don't need one. <laughs> um, but yeah, I did pick one up. It was in the sale. And it is actually a weather beater one. Now, I picked this up because I'm really liking the look of the poly pad ones at the moment they're a bit thicker and for breakers especially I thought they'd be really nice um and this was a similar sort of type it's quite thick I'm not going to take it out of the bag because I'm going to take it outside in a minute um but it's in this royal blue colour it's a weather beat one as I said and it is in size full and I got it for like 26 pounds I think is the main reason I picked it up where are you yeah it says 22 pounds 56 um but that's about the bat on it but yeah so i picked that one up and then the next thing i picked up i actually can't show you because it's my mum's christmas present um and she does watch my videos so i'm gonna leave that one out um just for the sake of her seeing it and then the next thing i picked up is kind of something i don't really need anymore um but i picked up one of the lumia arica rugs got it in six foot three so it'll fit portia pixie kira megan paprika it'll fit any of them um but it's an 100 gram which it's suddenly gone really cold so i don't really need one um i might put it underneath the paprika or megan because they're just in 200 gram turnouts but they haven't been clipped so i'm not sure but if not it'll be handy for spring um so that is that it's in navy and gray and i really like the look of these rugs i haven't got any of them so far um so i thought i would pick that up and that was 63 pounds 13 again without that so it's probably about 65 pounds i don't know don't quote me on that and then the next thing i got is actually a bit random um something for me so i picked up some joggers because i just don't have any that fit all the ones i've got have like shrunk in the wash and gone really small so i thought i'd pick some up um these are the lemire ones the lemire ladies jogger they were in the sale they were 50 pounds down to is it gonna focus there you go down to 30 pounds 84 um and they're in this licorice color it's like a brownie gray i'd say um with the like rusty orange detailing um but yeah i just wanted some to wear around the yard um or even over leggings to ride in like because i do a lot of hacking um i don't particularly need to wear jars and they're like fleece lined and lovely um so yeah i've just picked some of them up they are in a size eight because um, I wanted them to be like longer and a bit bigger so they fit me a bit better and then the next two things I have bought is why I needed to open this box because I need these um, so first of all it's a rug um, I wasn't bothered about branding or anything because this is actually for the folds so this one is for echo um it's in size four foot nine and it was pretty much anything i could find in that size i picked up because um there weren't many available in full sizes um so this is a saxon defiant 600g sanded neck medium so it hasn't got a neck um it's in navy and white and size four foot nine and that was 42 pounds 74 i think it was about 45 pounds of that i'm not sure and then the last one i picked up is for little meg uh not megan l <laughs> l um this again is a saxon one they seem to be the only people that do little size rugs this is in a funky print it's got like 
red unicorns on it, if you can see. Um, and this is in size four foot three, I believe, I hope. Yeah, four foot three, blue unicorn print. Um, again, this is, I don't know what weight this one is. Does it tell me? 180 grams, so again, sort of medium weight. The other one was 200 grams, so pretty similar. Um, and yeah, that is for L. So I'm gonna go and pop them on them now because it's really cold. Um, but yeah, that is everything I got. It's not a huge haul, but I wanted to get it out and show you so I can go and put their little books on. Couldn't get any cuter, she looks so cute. Echo, <laughs> not so much. Although they were both really good to have them on, to be fair. Thought Echo would have a bit of a tantrum, but she didn't. You look the cutest. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Should we show them? Shall we show them how cute you look? Look at Al. You show them your posh rug. Go on back then. Look at her. She looks so cute. <laughs> right, okay, I'm back to film the rest of this video. I thought I'd try and film it in front of the Christmas tree, but I'm literally basically sat in the Christmas tree. Um, but I thought I'd carry on with this video and kind of make it like a bit of a haul video. So the other day I received this month's Forelock and Fringe box, which you will have seen I unboxed the November one. It was actually part of Vlogmas because I filmed it in November, but it didn't go out to Vlogmas. So you hopefully should have seen that but I have got this month's as well now, so I thought I would unbox that for you and include it in this kind of haul video. My nails are just long enough to do the sticker on it. Um, I decided just to carry it over to this month. Um, I don't know how long I'll carry it on for, but for now, quite enjoying it. So, so first thing you get is one of these pole work setup card things. Um, it looks like a pretty simple one to be fair. Can you see that? Camera does not want to focus. There you go. Um, so yeah, just that is that one. Um, and it tells you all about what you can do with it and how many poles you need and yeah, all sorts of different stuff on there. And then also got a ball lock and fringe thing. Yeah, I think that just tells you like how much everything's worth. Oh gosh, I'm like previewing, previewing what's in the box. Don't want to do that. Um, so yeah, let's open the box and have a look. Ooh, this looks very exciting. Um, so the first thing that I saw is this. It's a Dodson and Horrell Grow Your Own Christmas Tree. Now I don't know if that's like a literal thing growing your own Christmas tree. Um, let's see. I'm not sure, but <laughs> grow your own Christmas tree. Um, so yeah, I don't know what, what if that's actually to grow your own Christmas tree. I will read that, but yeah. And then there's another little Dodson and Horror things. Now these things, as I said in the last video, I don't really love, um, but I think it's just, part of it and it makes it worth it the other stuff you get anyway so this is the Dodson and Horrell health mask which I haven't actually heard of before um so that is that again it's one of them sample bags it's a complimentary feed specifically for horses and ponies health mash I don't actually say what it really does to be fair um yeah it doesn't really tell me the benefits of it and aromatic herbal mash supporting immune and digestive function it's molasses free low in starch sugar and super fiber apparently um but yeah i don't know what i'll do with that because obviously that's a mash that i'll leave soaking so i don't know if i'll ever use that but it, i guess for some people that would be a handy thing to have um so yeah and the next thing i got is this a little face brush it's tiny tiny um this is the HY Shine one in cobalt pink. Um, so yeah, that is a face brush. I have to say, I don't really use face brushes that often because I just kind of brush them with a normal body brush. Um, but 
I actually don't know if I own a face brush or if I do, they're in like old boxes and really gross. So a handy thing to have, nice pink colour. Um, I think it tells me what the prices of these things are in here. <coughs> RRP £3.50. So yes, that is that one. And then the next thing we got is something for me again. So a little bar of chocolate. This is Whitaker's chocolate. Um, milk chocolate. Ooh. Jamie might be able to have this. I'm not sure. Um, Jamie's got a peanut allergy, so he can't have a lot of stuff. But I'm not that keen on like chocolate that isn't Capri's or Galaxy. Um, I, I like like the main brands of chocolate, but I'll give it a try. Um, so yeah, that's nice. Just. A 90 gram chocolate bar and alternative options for some dietary requirements I'm not sure um so yeah that is that and then next up we got a big bag of treats for the ponies which obviously is always greatly appreciated these are not treats that I've tried them on before they're the equilibrium products ones they're Molasses free and they're called Crunch It's and they look like quite funky treats to be fair. I don't know what like natural fruits and vegetables made with delicious peach root parsnip, banana and carrot. Interesting. Um, so yeah, I'll try them on then. Who knows whether they'll like them or not, but they look like almost like a healthy treat. So we'll see what they think of them but that's nice and they are up here at 4.99 so that is them and then next thing we just got a few of the vouchers so again three pound off the health mash um an equilibrium products flyer thing um elico equestrian bracelets and necklaces and stock pins on the back and then 15 percent off deli vita which by the looks of it is like a oven barbecue kind of company yeah um and then the next thing i got is some socks which is always handy i'm sure as a horse rider if any of you are well i'm presuming most of you are horse riders um you always need socks they're always going missing they're always getting holes in. Um, so socks is always really handy. So these are the Elico bamboo socks. They're in, I'd say these are navy. I can't quite tell, the lighting isn't great in here. Yeah, navy and then like got yellow horseshoes all over them. Um, so they're really nice. And they were, they, well, they are RP at 7 95 So that is them. Um, I won't get them out of the packaging, but always handy riding socks and then the last thing color is it Ooh, a dark green that's quite nice i don't own one of these in dark green let me just open the bag for you um so the main piece is a base layer um yeah it's in like this dark green color which is actually quite nice because i don't own a base layer in this colour. Um, this is the cold stream one and it's got like, I don't know how to explain it, this collar thing is really like different material. I don't know if it'll be tight on your neck because it's not elasticated um, but we'll see. It's sustainable, made from recycled plastic. Um, it's in size extra small because that's what I put on the thing but yeah it just looks really nice. It's got like Gold detailing it says, you can see it. it. Says cold stream, and then it's obviously got the gold zip, and it's got like a C there, which I'm not sure if you can see. Um, yeah, so that is really nice. I'm excited to try that on. Um, and yeah, a different colour for me, but I quite like it. So that was. RRP's at 59.99. Jesus. Yeah, so I could have got like can you see navy, the colour I got, like a purpley colour or a light blue. So 
I think that would, probably would have been the colour I'd gone for out of them four, to be fair. Um, so yeah, that is the four lock and fridge box. Um, so I think I'm going to leave this video here now. It's probably <laughs> been long enough with them two little haul clips. Um, so yeah, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like, comment and subscribe because it does really help me out. Um, but yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye bye.